Now we're going to make good old plain old fashioned meatloaf. Man, that's some lean meat. Oh yeah. my lord. That's the trouble is I mean unfortunately she always buys Wow, that's lean. Healthy looking, lean, grass fed, blah blah blah. So it's got no fat in it. Man, so, you ain't kidding. That's healthy. Yeah. But you know what comes with healthy? No fat. No fat. You lose a lot of flavor. It's true. You do. Onion helps though. Onion helps a lot. Onion and yeah. garlic is the lifesavers on this one. These bad boys, the crackers. That's what we grew up on. Yeah, we used to load that. Our burgers were made Everything with crackers. Everything was loaded with crackers. And it was like we joke about it, but you could tell how poor we were at the time. Oh, the volume of crackers yeah. in there. <laughs> See, a little bit of meat and a ton of That's why you crackers. wanted the fattiest meat you oh, could get. It was. Because... And that's meatloaf. And I know that sucked up so much of it. Oh, yeah. So this is going to be a little different. It's going to be different. But we're going to try to see how it comes out. Yeah. So we got a pound of ground beef. I've got like 20 crackers here that yeah. I'm just going to. Hey, you remember the Singer meatloaf? The Singer meatloaf? Meatloaf. Oh, yeah, the yeah, Singer a, meatloaf. Okay. Yeah, he's a big fella. Oh, yeah, yeah. I do anything for love, but I won't do that, that guy. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. He's a big fella. You yeah. know, I used to roadie for him, didn't you? You did? You know what they used to call me? <laughs> what? Hamburger helper. <laughs> <laughs> That is so bad. That is so That's bad. That's funny. Oh, God. Hamburger helper. <laughs> Don't know who meatloaf is. That's funny. Oh, man. That's funny. Oh. My jokes are usually... That's funny. You're cracking me up. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to steal my spot. So we got about 20 crackers in there. Yep. Uh, we're going to need... A, I'm going to put about three tablespoons of onions in here. I already diced all these onions. But I'm only going to put about three tablespoons in there. Two... Yeah. And three heaping tablespoons, but tablespoons. You know what I'd be putting in there? What would you put in I'd there? I'd be putting in bacon, but then I've had, you've had, you had bacon and burgers before, haven't you? Yep. I've had it before where it was like rubber. It you doesn't work. You bit it, and it didn't cook all the way right. through. It just doesn't work out well. No. What do we got here? I got a, it's a half teaspoon. So we're going to put in a half teaspoon of salt. You need to let me buy you some fatty ground beef. We just won't tell your wife. I have to sneak it in the back door. Yeah. Cause that's where all the flavor is. Oh, it is. And we're gonna put about a teaspoon of salt, a uh, pepper, but I'm just gonna do it this way because I'd rather have the fresh ground. It is good. Somewhere between a half a teaspoon and a teaspoon of pepper. You know, if you weren't forced to eat super healthy ground beef, you oh. get 80-20. Even 80-20 is not really that, it's still for- It's good now. Oh. What you need to get is the old kind. It's about 73 73 They sell yeah. it still. Oh, yeah. But, it yeah, 73 makes killer burgers. Yeah, well, it's much more fat. Yeah. In it. it would be, it's the best stuff for meatloaf and stuff like oh, that. Oh, it is, because you need that fat. So it's going to be a lot healthier meatloaf. There's one, two teaspoons of minced garlic. Teaspoons, not tablespoons. Okay. Just so everybody doesn't get that made. It'd be some really garlicky meatloaf. If you so this is going to be a healthier meatloaf because I'm, I'm it, getting it some only because of the fact we're having to use this other crap. That I've been getting some people saying you guys ought to eat eat something healthy. <laughs> or, I guess hinting that we should make some healthier food, but I, I think they were really meaning that we need to eat healthier. They probably were, but we don't eat, we don't eat bad. No, Most we of the don't stuff eat we that eat much. Is actually, we're hardly ever eating. We're we're just busy. We're just cooking for everyone else. Yeah, that's what we do. Just out of the love for them. Yep. And I so, almost choked myself up. There they are, calling in right now. Yep. That's probably Meals on Wheels, one of them other <laughs> volunteer organizations. It's probably calling to get your, wanting you to come in and do something nice for oh, them. Oh, I thought you were saying they were delivering the food. Delivering your food. Delivering your, you're delivering the food. One for me, one for you. Next <laughs> yeah. house. Yeah. I'm getting a little hungry again. Meals on wheels. Yeah, I don't make fun of nobody, but <laughs> but Larry's mom would get some of that. Would she? she? Her cat wouldn't eat some of the stuff they brought. <laughs> well, it's like most of those things. People people do things with the best of intentions sometimes. Oh, it doesn't always quite work out yeah. the way you anticipate. I guess some anyway. of their meals go seriously south. We well, gotta figure. I don't know how they do. They get their stuff donated or what? I don't. Know. I don't know. So if they do, then you know, you never know what you're going to be working with. I would think. Yeah, like that's rough. I mean, if you had to, you know, a bunch of you know, chicken beaks and asses or something, <laughs> it's like that ain't going to turn out a real no. good meal. Yeah. 
I don't like chicken feet. Well, some people I, do. Some people like chicken feet. I know. I, I've seen a lot of folks, some recipes out. Yeah. There's said, you ever that tried this? And it's like, well, oh, Dad no. I think Dad had chicken feet before. Pickled pig feet. Yeah, he pickled pig feet, too. I mean, I couldn't do it. They're, they're different. We're going to have to fix chitlins one of these days. That's a, I can't do that one. No? <laughs> I can't. I've never done it. Maybe someday I'll go, I'll go to a restaurant that's got them and I'll try them. But it's not something that... If I if I gotta have somebody cook it right first, yeah, so we need that, to run over to Edwin and Darnell's Soul Shack. They we serve it all the time. <laughs> There's our little meatloaf. All right, I'm gonna put it in this skillet here. They can't see that, which is the one that's got the the grit the griddle marks in the bottom yeah. of it, because that'll help the it won't stick as bad. And the grease will drain out the bottom. Yeah. If there were any grease, I don't think we're going to see much grease. Yeah, you're draining not going to see grease. But That's super late. And then we're going to put that in the oven probably for about a half an hour till it's, it's getting nice and brown on the outside. Then we're going to hit it with the ketchup, which is the, 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 the magical ingredient that makes all the meatloafs oh, come yeah. out good. It's ketchup over the top of it. No, I hate it when they don't have ketchup on them. Some people like brown gravy on them. I mean, I I've had them both man, ways. Man, I'm telling you, I just... I guess from growing up, that's like everybody. Ours was always ketchup. Yeah, it had to be ketchup. So I'm putting this into a 400 degree oven. 400 degrees. And we're going to let that go. And we'll be back to you when we pull it out to put some ketchup on it. I can pull it out because I got that roadie experience. And, and you know, my hamburger nickname, helper. Hamburger helper. That would work. Yeah. It's right there. All right. We'll be back in just a bit. Okay. So we're getting ready to, the meatloaf's been in there about 20, almost 30 minutes. Okay. Let me stop that. Stop. All right. And we're going to pull that back out of here. There's our meat Look rope. at those crumbs. And it's oh, sizzling. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no fat, man. That's crazy. I know. You can see there's been no wow. fat right now. Nothing, nothing like mama's. No. You can see there's no, usually the fat will make it so that it you move around real freely. And, yeah. And it's just stuck a little bit so it's going to be a healthy version yeah it's probably going to be as tasty as mom's was because there just ain't enough fat in there yeah oh yeah so it's loose now i just like to make sure it's loose before we get started now i just grab the ketchup i don't measure this it's probably about a quarter of a cup is about what actually you use of it but i just run it isn't it funny that uh, the only time I consider meatloaf meatloaf is when it's got ketchup on top oh, of I it? Oh, I know. And it's got to be cooked onto there. So there's... Is that regional or what is that? Because I get some people that like the brown... Brown gravy, right. Yeah. And it's like, man, that's not meatloaf. That's, yeah, that's I mean, Southbury steak almost. <laughs> right, exactly. That's what it. That's the way I always kind of looked at it. Because that's what I like. I like to get some extra ketchup on there. Yeah, I'll put and it's it. so funny because I eat cheeseburgers plain, so I don't like ketchup on my cheeseburger, but, but I like it on here. It's on so meatloaf, weird. Right. And, and I know it's, because uh, you get people talking about it. It's the way mom made it or grandma made it. Oh, exactly. It. It's just what you're used you're to. You're locked in. So that's All got right. that. We're going to put me this. Get the, let me get this for you. Yep. Turn the letter, Vanna. Turn the letter. Yeah, there we go. All right. So we'll put that back in. It probably only need about 15 minutes, and we'll be back. Pull that out. We'll be back by 15. All right. Okay, we're getting ready to pull the meatloaf All right. out. And there she be. All right. So that came out. I can hear it sizzling. It's sizzling. So I'm going to take and... Let me see. I'll cut off the other side so you can see what we're getting. This is super hot, so... Well, I can hear it. Man, I wouldn't want to touch my hand on that. Nope, I don't you want, want to. You want to pull that out of there? I, I hate cutting. I like, I like my skillets. So you can hear. Whoa, that's hot. It's super hot. We'll take, put that bad boy out there. I want a little more ketchup. Steal some ketchup off of here. But I do love ketchup. Yeah. <laughs> Where's a fork at? I you know, we haven't had anybody putting signs up, like roll it from the middle. and. I know. 
and all that today. This has been interesting. I think they're starting to catch on that we are pretty good at this yeah. stuff. We need some forks, though. I need some forks. We're, we're stage crew. You, you know, I used to be a roadie for meatloaf, don't you? <laughs> I think you told me that story. <laughs> Finger looking good. All right. Thank you. You know, I'm going to take this top part. Where the kitchen Oh, wow. I thought it was going to be, like, tough. It's, it's No, it's not Man. tough. Wow. It's, not what it's, I expected. It's going to be hot. Oh, yeah. I'm letting you get burn your mouth first. Oops. Wow. That's actually not bad. I thought it was going to be a lot worse because... <laughs> a lot worse? <laughs> because we, we used the, wow. uh, the, the super lean ground beef. Yeah. But by the time you put the crackers and the onions and everything else in there, I'd still... I would, yeah. if it was me, if I was doing it again, we had that 95% or whatever yeah, crazy that's, stuff that's what, was. That's what your wife said. It was 95%. I just asked her. Yeah. And yeah, you, uh, you're not going to fly with that unless you're really healthy. I mean, I mean, this isn't bad for... We've been... Uh, considering there's no, hardly any fat in here at all, but you can see the skill is black. There's no... Oh, there's none. There's no puddles none. of grease around, which <laughs> mom's had a little... Mom. It was sitting in a little puddle of grease at the end. That's actually pretty good. Right. I... I uh, but I like I like a little more fat in there personally. Right. But now if I got this, I wouldn't complain. No. I mean, but if I'm making it, don't use anything higher than eighty twenty with this. Yeah. If yeah. you only get the seventy three percent, that's more like what we grew up on. Yeah, it is. It is because it was super fatty. But yeah, you know, fat adds flavor. There's no way to hide it, <laughs> as you know. <laughs> we we do like our fat. You know what? A friend of mine. Uh, said that that his mom and their family his mom and family use a different term because they'll see somebody who's put on weight mm -hmm. <laughs> you're gonna love this <laughs> instead of saying man they really got fat mm -hmm. his mom would say oh she's really got a lot she's got kind of fleshy, <laughs> <laughs> fleshy. <laughs> so it's kind of like a pear or <laughs> <laughs> she's getting fleshy a plum <laughs> it just Fleshy. I, I like said that's going to be my new my new term. The Fleshy Brothers. Yeah, <laughs> we'll change our, our website. Yeah. Oh, that's we'll do that when we have that vegan website. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll be all over that vegan, one. Vegan website. <laughs> yeah, as we're eating bacon and oh my gosh, meatloaf and everything else imaginable. Hey, okay. but this one is definitely because considering we use that super lean stuff. It turned out great. I was scared to death that it was going to be like dried bad. out and nasty. Yeah. Yes. Wow. That's pretty good. Yeah. It's, it's if, good. And when they get kind of, let me get beat up a little bit about, don't you guys ever do anything healthy? And I said, no, not really. But this is a healthy meatloaf. Right. I mean, if you, um, there's no fat in here to speak of. I if mean, if you really told me you could do this with a 95% lean, I would have never believed right. it. Right. I, I would have thought it would be like shoe leather. No, no, it's, it's actually not. really good. Yeah, it turned out well. But again, you're like me. I, I'd, I'd go for the, I would definitely go for the 73 or whatever it is. Right. Or at least at least the 80-20. 80-20 would have been product. okay. But yeah, this one's easy. Yeah, two thumbs, two thumbs up. up yeah, that's, but yeah, yeah, very good. So much better than I was expecting this. And yep. I hate to say that. I know you're not supposed to say stuff like that on videos, but, it's but I'm honest. We you're failed. honest. We've had fails that we if, put out. Yeah, if, so. it, if it was a... If it sucked, we'd say if it If it sucks. was a flamer, I'd, uh, I'd we'd, say it. We'd throw it out there and go, yep, that didn't yeah. work at all. No, good. Very good. Thank all you right, very thank much. Thank you. See you soon. Bye.